Okay, tonight we're going to be talking about who's going to win the belt at Night of Champions. Um, there's three guys, in my opinion, who have a chance at this. One is Brock Lesnar. This is an outside chance, in my opinion, because he's a part-timer. They already have a part-time champion in Roman Reigns, and I don't think they're going to want to do that again. But, I mean, it's Brock Lesnar. There, When it comes to WWE, there's always a uh, outside chance when it comes to Brock Lesnar. Um, the second one is Seth freaking Rollins. Um, I mean, the cold hard facts are he's one of the best wrestlers in WWE right now. Whether they treat him like it or not, he hasn't had the belt for a while. And he needs a good title run, in my opinion. Um, and he would be a great choice. He's a, he's a wonderful wrestler. He's definitely in my top five in, the, in WWE right now. So, yeah, he's definitely got to be one of them. Uh, before we get to number one, uh, please like and subscribe. It really helps the channel. And so, yeah, now number one. Uh, got to be Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes is white hot right now. He is at the top of the business. They should have given it to him at WrestleMania, but they didn't. Um, I think they maybe regret that because a lot of people weren't too thrilled about it. And I mean, I, I guess they wanted to keep it on Roman Reigns, but I don't know why. I guess they wanted to get him to get to that 1,000 mark. But um, yeah, so I'm thinking that he is it's going to be between him and Seth Rollins at Night of Champions, and I think Cody's going to end up with the belt, and that might actually end up setting up a. Uh, a uh, match between uh, him and Roman Reigns, non-title match, just for like uh, respect, like because Roman has the uh, whole "I never lost the belt" uh, angle there. So it should, it'll be interesting to see what goes on afterwards. But I, yeah, I definitely think it will be Cody Rhodes in the end, and let's hope so. Peace out, everybody.